yeah, we've been here a couple of days already. I don't know if we look a little bit red. I'm but... very red, very burnt. Oh, very okay. <laughs> yeah. So in this video, uh, if you if you watch us regularly, thank you for tuning in, or if you're just interested in seeing the hotel, this is our first ever sort of hotel tour vlog, so we'll see how it goes. We've already filmed some clips uh, from the breakfast. Uh, throughout the week, we'll be just doing different clips of yeah like the food on the night see. entertainment yeah um, uh, all, what drinks you can yeah, get all of the facilities the pools uh, we'll show you how to get to the beach area there's okay. loads to see and do yeah. we've been here three days now it's a huge resort it's there's lovely so, it's so much fun as well yeah. and the service is incredible yeah of the waiters and the staff um, so if you are interested in seeing all of that and you, you're planning to come here then yeah uh, watch this video, we'll show you everything you need to know. Starting off then, we thought we'd uh, show you the a little room tour. We've, this, this is just a standard room. Yeah, we we've, we've got a standard um, double room. But yeah, well firstly, let's look at the view from our balcony, because we are on the sixth floor. Uh, we've got a lovely view facing the golf course, obviously being uh, a golf resort. It does have a golf course for people who want to pay for that. Nice. People still play at this time of the day. You yeah. Can, I just like how with this view we can see the Land of Legends theme park over there. Yeah, if you can just make out the uh, the, the lit up blue yeah. there. We've actually been there today. But opposite the what um, the, the what about the fountain. Um, we it can looks see lovely. The just to the right of us here. Yeah, and during the uh, daytime you can see the sea yeah. over there. We did ask about a pool view room mm. um but because of the construction you can that's one thing at the moment you can hear it hear it during the day so we decided this room is lovely isn't yeah. it yeah well i mean as of filming now may 2023 they haven't completely finished no. uh, the renovations yet so there is minor construction nothing that's affected our holiday no. but yeah that's uh, something to keep in mind over the next couple of months but yeah let's uh, show you the room then so you can see here we've got a massive Mirror. Yeah, and it's lovely ready dust. Get makeup or your hair. Um, huge seat here. Yeah, nice seating area. Coffee table. Got lots of light switches up on me as well. Phone, drawers. You can put all of these. They actually have in. a digital menu as well. Which I think for um for room service. I think it's the yellow carts and the room service as well. Yeah. It's got spare information on there as well. And then loads of storage, drawers, you can watch a huge, huge TV, TV. Which, do you ever watch TV on holiday? Well, we haven't even know? turned it on. No, you just don't bother. No. The bed is always nicely made the next day. Yeah, it's lovely. Um, when we came back, she made swans, didn't she, with the towels. Yeah, and it's a huge bed. I think it's a queen. It's really cool. Yeah, it's bigger than our bed at home. Yeah, I really like the lamps as well. Yeah, lovely really decor. Nice. A nice picture frame, and here is the aircon, uh, which we woke up freezing oh, this really, morning. Really yeah, it? well, that's our fault for having it on all night. You've got all of your coffee facilities. Yep. We always get fresh water, drinks, yep. loads here. You said as well that it's all branded with yeah, Titanic, branded with the sugar. sugar. <laughs> yeah. We just wait until we go down again. You also going. have uh, a mini fridge and complimentary. All your drinks. Um, we did have more than this, but we've drank yeah, some today. Fun. But yeah, they, they restock that every day, which is great. And look how much storage you've got for shoes. Yeah. Oh, anything. You can put your clothes and stuff in there. They give you as well. Robes. Two robes. We haven't and used. I think there were some slippers. I did. Oh, that yeah, one. slippers there. And a free to use safe, which is really easy and straightforward. Keep all of your passports and money yeah. and things in there. I think even though they haven't got a wardrobe as such, it's still like plenty of sort of storage, isn't it? Yeah. To put your things in. And then the bathroom, which is heavy, really nice. Yeah, lovely Marble. shower. Beautiful. It's massive. It's like one of them power showers. Yeah. It's so warm. It's very nice. And, and then here. loads of stuff here. All complimentary shower gels and any bits you may have forgot to bring. Toothbrush, yeah. um, we had a razor in there which I've been using. Yeah, well there's a spare one there as well. Yeah, Toothpaste. Lots. Shampoo, conditioner, all your usual. Yeah, mirror. And hairdryer as well, which is just Attached. in here. Already plugged in yeah. for you. And obviously fresh towels every day. So we'll say, like, the 
extended room is It's beautiful. very nice. Yeah, it's just enough what we need because we're never in it. So. Of course you can upgrade and a huge mirror just here. They do have some beautiful um, villas and they've got the Maldives, Maldives room which looks out over onto the pool as well. Yeah. But a lot of money. <laughs> the entire resort is stunning though and yeah, we can't wait to show you the rest of it. So uh, this morning we actually filmed uh, breakfast. We went down and showed you there. So I'll put that clip in now. And yeah, we'll take it from there, but we'll try and show you everything yeah. that the Titanic has to offer in this video. So we are on the sixth floor of the hotel. Yeah. Get a good view. Obviously use the lifts to get down to the breakfast. There is four Wait for one now. So breakfast is in the main buffet hall and it's on from 8 till 11 a.m. And Stacy hasn't even been to see it yet. I don't really eat breakfast. <laughs> no. I've only come down see, once. Yeah. Yeah, so you can get breakfast, lunch, and dinner here. Or oh, breakfast, dinner, tea if you're in the north. <laughs> we usually just have our dinner off. Yeah. We'll have a look around then. Yeah, the kids' corner there. You can get pancakes. Well, this is the one that they want and they said as well, it's the two sisters that work oh. here. So many different seasons. Yeah. What are these? Toast. And round here, all of the yogurts. Currently staff members are serving you food, but you can obviously get as much as you want. What? Mozzarella sticks. Oh, for, for breakfast. breakfast. This actually looks pretty good. Spring roll with meat. Yeah, there's loads of choice. I love you've got a um, cheese one there, French toast, mozzarella sticks. Mozzarella sticks. Yeah. Loads of different options. Try not to eat a lot of bread. No. So what can you like that? Eating all this well just food. We'll go around this way. The olive station. You have to eat car the top. Yeah. You're feeling healthy. Can't be healthy if you want. Yeah, to. all a solid bar. Got more eggs at the back. Fries. Fried eggs. Mm. And then you go in. The main hall's there to sit down. You've got all your hands. Yeah. And what's this got here? All the cheese as well. Loads of different cheese. We are booked in for the a la carte tomorrow night. Yeah, I'm looking forward to an a la carte on the night. Yeah. So yeah, so that is 
all of the breakfast options at the buffet. I'd say it's one of the best that Buy we've beans. Beans. Yep. Milky scramble then. Lords. Right, we're going to get some food now, yeah, and we'll pick this vlog up probably tomorrow where we'll show you more of the main grounds. Okay, it's Wednesday morning now. Thought we'd give you a little tour of uh, most of the grounds. So we'll start off in the lobby area. It's beautiful. It's so nice. I love these big chandeliers that they have only one. Yeah, feels so grand. The lobby is huge with all of the stairs going down to the bottom. Yeah, we'll we'll go down to the restaurants afterwards. So first up there's the Cordella Lobby Bar. Mm. Half 11, yeah. We've got the golf lounge tonight. Yes, golf lounge. And I think guest services is just here. So if you have any queries about anything really, taxis or. They did, they helped us, help us get the bus. We got the bus to London Legends. Yeah. It worked out about 90 Yeah, <laughs> it wasn't a lot. Seating area and yeah, a little little snacks and drinks as you make your way into the hotel. Chocolate, champagne, you can just have as much as Lemonade, you want. Yeah. Here is the hotel entrance. And down here is the reception desk. And they are always happy to assist. Huge area that we haven't even been in here yet. Yeah, I think it's just like a relaxing mm. lounge here. Some sort of lounge. And yeah, there's uh, more rooms. There's a conference, big conference oh, there. Uh, yeah, so here's uh, all of the rooms and then yeah, the lobby and the, the kids club and the restaurants are all at the uh, ground just beneath us which we will head to now. So to help keep you fit when you're all inclusive, we do have all these stairs to walk down to the pools and the shops. Yeah. You do have the lift. <laughs> yeah, of course. It's just nice to come down here because I think it's absolutely gorgeous. It's a lovely area to come and chill out in. And the yeah, waterfall in the middle. Smells lovely. That's one thing we noticed, the smell throughout the hotel. Yeah, it's got, I don't know if it's got like pods, but I don't know, but it just, it just smells so nice and fresh. Coming through here, as mentioned. Uh, ah, look, that's another thing. Oh Loads of cute cats. There's so many. Yeah, I like to come in. They all actually look really well kept. Yeah, they must, the, must get, get fed. Snacks, yeah, so we showed this when we showed the the buffet restaurant. Here is the main restaurant area, and yeah, we'll we'll also we've got a la carte tonight, but we'll film the uh, dinner. Uh, which is open from half six till quarter past nine, yeah. another night. Yep. Yep, but that is the schedule for the summer. That looks good, doesn't it? Yeah. So here is a few shops. Got all of your knockoffs, <laughs> bags. Yeah, they are. We head this way. No, thank you. There is a guy offering shoe shine as well. Little things like that throughout the hotel. We love this area. Yeah. This is our favourite one of my favourite parts. Because here is the nightclub. I'll actually put, we've, we came here Sunday night, I'll put some clips in later on, but yeah, the uh, club we were in 
last night as well. Yeah. So here's a little look at it during it's the day. When it's all lit up at night. Yeah. You have a stage over here and all dancers. Yeah. Different theme nights. Yeah, it's good. This is part of the um, seating area for the buffet. We do have um, an adults only area that you can An adults only area oh, and the, the the villa area. And this is a beautiful area. It reminds me of like a French cafe. Yeah, so here is the patisserie. Another one of our favourite places. Yeah, we'll have to show you there, we'll yeah, there's nothing on at the minute, but this is filled with cakes and ice creams yeah. during the day. Okay. We'll come back later to show that. We also had a nice um, cappuccino, chocolate one. Yeah, it's lovely. Whipped cream. Yeah, more seating. We usually sit on this side. Don't we? Yeah. Heading outside now, then, to the main pool area. Outdoor seating. We've got five pools here. <laughs> this is the 24 hour bar. So they usually have uh, the football on these huge TVs on the night. Uh, lovely comfy seats here. Yeah, you can drink 24 hours. So here's a look at the huge main pool. And I haven't been in it yet. No, you I have. I've been for a swim Yeah, I'll go for a swim today. All the way on this second pool, all the way underneath the villas, all the way around the back. Yeah, <laughs> I was so tired when I came. Yeah. You mentioned earlier the construction isn't 100% complete yet, so as an example, there is the old water park which is getting uh, renovated. So the, them slides are operating again, aren't we've they? Got the, we've got the new There ones. is new slides There's which new we'll slides. show. They're just renovating the old slides. Yeah. We've not actually showed you this pool either, um, but we've never even been in yeah. this one, have we? We'll show you it uh, down here which is at the far end of the hotel. So here's a look at the temporary stage area which they have on for evening entertainment. Last Pro night, on one of these, I fell off. Yeah, be careful on the little I'd steps. I only had two drinks, I wasn't sure. <laughs> so you just got to be really careful because it was so like dimly lit, wasn't it? By the time you watch this, this is probably gone now yeah. because they are building the new stage area which is all the way down there by these water slides. It's a long walk, isn't it? Yeah, so we'll show that. All of the tables and of course there's a bar at the back there. You can see a bit of construction behind. And here is just a, a little pool that nobody really seems to go no, to. It's quite out of the way. It's pretty out of the way. Okay. Yeah. We've got volleyball here and also I think that's some more football. Yeah. Okay. Let's look at some of the balconies. We are on the other side. I wouldn't right. like to have this one here right next to the no. stage. We've got a pretty good location, I think. Another bar on the night there. Let's go further across the main pool, show you some more of that. Yeah, we love the cocktails here, don't we? Here's a look at the different coffees you can get. Iced coffees. That's when we get the firm. All of the different liquor. This is so much choice. Yeah, lovely. We'll head over to the indoor pool and the outdoor heated pool. There's a, a spa as well. Currently, the Italian a la carte because that's still getting built over by the riverside. Yeah. But at night time, it also becomes the midnight snack bar. Yeah, we which, is, nice which is burger. handy. Yeah, it's open from, I believe, 11 till 2. Yes. Yeah, and we had a, a cheeseburger at about <laughs> half one last night. It's lovely. And it's a very nice burger as well. It's a little uh, so that's what it station is. where you can purchase a la carte and gazebos. So if you can see here, this is what it used to look like. Yeah. It's not been knocked out. Um, so we're not getting the full experience at the moment, but once it's done, It'll be lovely. And here's a little look at the map of the hotel. And it, yeah, there is the, the beach, which we're going to go to shortly, which you can get to by train or boat. If you feel like splashing out, you can purchase a gazebo uh, for 150 euros per day. 
So not the cheapest, but it does look comfy. And of course you get these sun beds, where, which they aren't available anywhere else on the resort. No, but you don't get Quite that. Quite private. Sort of thing, do you? Yeah. Quite shaded. Maybe, maybe that's why people want it. If there's quite a few of you, the split, that's not too bad. I'll head this way. We haven't even been into the spa yet. No. We need to come in. We've got ice bottles. Oh, it's hot. They'll probably steam up the camera. <laughs> Oh, it's cold yeah, as you walk in. Oh, yeah, it was hot on the outside, but it's freezing in here. This is lovely. That's very nice. We need to come in. Shower area and is there a sauna as well? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Have to be careful. I know I've tried to film people, but there's a sauna. Bigger than our sauna, Ooh, you can feel that. Oh, it's beautiful. Huge. It's huge. Wow. We haven't even seen this. No. We've been here three days. <laughs> Didn't mean that. There's also the Turkish bath area which is included. Again, this is the first time we're seeing this. What's the water like? Not as cold as one. Yeah. Nice and relaxing in here. Ooh, shock, shock pool. pool. And pool. put your foot in. Oh, God. Freezing. So much up here, is it just seating areas? It's just like a pipe zone. Yeah. Relaxing. You can get uh, massages here, obviously you have to pay an upcharge, I'm not sure where they are. But yeah, this is a nice relaxing area here. And it's pretty quiet as well. Right, let's head back downstairs, we'll show you the gym and the indoor pool, yeah. Here is the spa reception. And yeah, if you want to keep fit, here is the gym. Lots of cold water at the ready. And yeah, this gym is huge. It's about the size of our gym we have back at home. Again, I haven't been in here yet. <laughs> I need to. I've ate far too much. Yeah, loads of different machines and free weights. They also have a vitamin bar, which we tried the juice the other day and it was lovely. It's all fresh, freshly squeezed. here as well. Yeah. Here's the indoor pool. One thing to point out, you don't need towels because they are provided and they're very nice and comfy. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah, we'll go in this today. Because the other pillows are freezing. <laughs> yeah, we love this pool. It's more quiet as well. And what sort of accommodation is this? Ah, uh, yeah, barley houses. And then if you cut through this way, it'll take you to 
the other side of the main pool. Then we can go up to the Olympic one. Yeah. Hmm. Like being at Venice, little bridge there. Yeah, you wouldn't believe that this hotel is actually pretty busy at the moment. <laughs> There's no one here, but it's just so big, isn't it's it? So, yeah, we, but we thought that because last night when we went for a drink, yeah. it was heaving. There were so many people about, but because it's that big, they're just all different areas to go. Don't forget as well, you can go over to the beach. Yeah. So up this ramp then. There's another bar there. Oh, what we love, don't we, is the staff bring you your drinks. Yeah. Because it's that big. We brought the skirt. Yeah. The yeah, they're very uh, attentive, the staff. And up here is the Olympic pool, which, again, we haven't been in yet. There is a uh, diving board. Yeah, not many people come up here. But if you do want to do some lengths, it's a good place to do it. It's <laughs> <laughs> And then just through this cut here takes you out to the balconies of some of the more expensive rooms at the Titanic. And a look at the main pool on the other side. So yeah, we normally just sunbathe around here. There's plenty of choice, bearing in mind it is early May. I don't really know what it's going to be like in July, August time. I think they're aiming for the um, start of June for it all to be completely renovated. Yeah. What time is it now? It is 12 o'clock. Right. Uh, Lunch time starts at 12.30. So we're actually going to go to a snack bar that we haven't been to yet. We usually go to the one by the water slides, which uh, does lovely pizza. But yeah, we'll take you in this other one, which I think will do a sim similar menu. And then the plan is to get the boat over to the beach area. So we'll pick the vlog up once we get over there. Just had a nice sunbathe for an hour or so then. So down here is all of the a la carte restaurants, which we will show shortly. First, we're going to the lunch restaurant, the Hazer restaurant. Not been to this yet. No, we're not 100% sure, but we think that may be one of the a la carte restaurants. And yeah, we're right by the river here. Just gone 12 30, so there's loads of seating. Lovely, and yeah, as mentioned, further down you can get the boat to the beach, just a five minute ride, which we will go once we've been here. Here's a little look at the menu then. Soup of the day, salads. I had the tuna salad yesterday, which was pretty nice. A hamburger, cheeseburger. I'm gonna get them. The dumplings. Meat dishes. Donna with sauce. Grilled meatballs, which I've had, they were nice. And yeah, desserts. Stacey's has gone for the dumplings. Dumplings with garlic and yogurt sauce. So nice. It's actually really nice. Yeah. I'm not having much here. I want to have a pizza over at the other snack bar, but I have just ordered chicken soup, so I'll see what that tastes like. Yeah, the chicken soup also really nice. They have different soups of the day on. This is absolutely beautiful. Yeah. I'm going to finish this and yeah, we'll show you the uh, other snack bar, which is just down by the water slides. Mm. So I'm guessing one of these two here are some of the a la carte. Yeah, that aren't finished yeah. yet. So last Friday, the Greek restaurant was meant to open. Mm. And also the Italian is meant to be down here. But currently the Italian is operating inside with the seafood restaurant, which is where we're eating at tonight. Yeah, I don't know if we've mentioned prices for the a la carte, actually. Yeah, the, so the current prices is 25 euros per person for all of them except the beef which is 49 euros, yeah. So pr quite pricey but we have heard the beef is meant to be amazing mm. which is actually just coming up here. Yeah, so this is one of the new buildings that only recently opened a few weeks ago we believe. As you can see there, this sign for the Asian a la carte and the beef is inside. 
beach looks lovely. Yeah, you can see there one of the boats just leaving for the beach. They are very frequent. You can also get there by train. Oh, we can't use the train today. We were going to get the boat anyways, but yeah, um, in the summer season you can use the train as well. Hmm. It's lovely. And as mentioned, here's a look at the water park area where some of the slides, some of the older slides are actually under construction, getting refurbished. Yeah, you can tell they're old. But the brand new ones go to the other side. Yeah. They operate, I think, half one till five o'clock. Yep. So there's the children's slides. And round here, all of the new slides have recently put in. You went on one the other day. It was so fun, yeah. Here is another snack restaurant, which we're going to go in now. Because they do lovely pizza. And I'll show you what that looks like. Similar to the other menu, but a little bit more choice at this one. So again, you've got the soup of the day, salads, burgers. I think it's got more choice because we're right next to yeah. the kids. Also, pizza. Yeah, we've tried the four varieties of cheese, which is lovely. I'll get that in a sec. And also the uh, roast beef is very nice. You can also get spaghetti as well. This is the four cheese pizza. And we've also got the margarita one. I can see stone baked. Beautiful, it's just in the corner over there. Yeah. And as well, you get all of your mayonnaises, Heinz, tomato ketchup, mustard. Lovely. I've actually just seen the train going past, so yeah, it must be fixed now. It's back on now. Yeah. I'm gonna eat this and then get to the pool, the beach, the beach. <laughs> Here's a closer look at some of the new slides which have recently opened. This huge green one's really fun. Obviously you go around in a ring. And this way leads to the other slides down here, which I don't know if they're new or if they've been there a while, I'm, I'm not sure. But yeah, loads of different slides, where well, there's four, five, six, seven different ones there including that yellow one which looks pretty scary. As Stacey mentioned, they open from 1.30, so in about half an hour. And also, closer look at the boulder slides, which aren't finished yet. And here are the children's slides. Right, so I know we said we were getting the boat across, but I thought we get the train, it was about to leave, and we haven't done it yet. We'll get the boat on the way back. We use the new um, short end. Yeah, obviously there is a bit of construction going on right now, though you can't hear it with it being so far away. That will be the new stage. Apparently that's going to be finished in a week's time. Yeah, it's, a bit, so. it's a bit far off that. Yeah. yeah, head over to the beach now then, where there is animals to see. And dogs the deck. Yeah, and obviously some beds and pier as well, so we'll show you all of that. Here's also a little look at the sister hotel, the Cullinan, which is walking distance. We can actually go and see that, we might do that on Friday. And yeah, obviously a huge golf course. now just took three or four minutes look there's goats chickens <laughs> oh. it's hot for them yeah cute very cute yeah the farm so you can pay for horse riding This is where you wait for the boat. Yeah, and here are the dogs. Ah, oh, bless him. Must be hot for them. I know it's sad that they are chained. Hopefully they do get to leave this area throughout the day. 
There's another one just behind there. Lovely. <laughs> we miss our dog. Can't wait to see Callie. Let's go to the beach. Honestly, we don't know how some people do two weeks of an all-inclusive. No. Like we're on day four and we're, we, we're sick of eating. I know, I know. God knows how much weight we are. I know. So full after that pizza, we won't be eating anything to the seafood a la carte tonight, which is at 8 p.m. Here's a look then at the beach area. You can actually play football. Field, yeah, there is the restaurant which is new, isn't it? Yeah, it's brand new for the yeah. show. Yeah. Walk around here. Yeah, here's a new sign for the Titanic recently installed, leading down to the restaurant where we had a uh, chicken kebab the other day. It's lovely. It also do burgers and stuff like that. These the page. Gazebos, yeah. Here's a look at the beach. There is a second gym. It's all made out of wood, that's good. And all of the sunbeds. There's loads. Yeah. You can get drinks from there. Loads more towels. And yeah, they do volleyball. There's a huge park at the back there for kids. And just walk along here. See they're still building, doing a few refurbs on the beach as well. This should all be done within a couple of months. I think you can get ice cream as well there. Do snacks like Doritos. Yeah, it might have been ice cream actually. Yeah. Hello, yes, uh, we will get an ice cream. Yeah, looks nice. Okay, I can't resist an ice cream when it's all included. Again, Titanic branding. They've gone for the chocolate and I think it's like raspberry and vanilla maybe. Yeah, so that's pretty much the beach area then obviously leads out to the lovely sea and there's a pier there as well. Yeah. Uh, the waves and here's a look at the pier where the sunbeds are included here it's loads free so we might chill here for an hour now where do you want to sit just here yeah, get some more towels yeah there's the paid for gazebos on the other side Tom unfortunately cannot swim, so we can only go so far in. <laughs> I've just been all the way over there, and it actually is quite strong, the sea water. It's stinging my neck. <laughs> How beautiful. Obviously in the summer, you can get um, temperatures of up to 40 degrees. Very, very hot. Similar to when we went to Texas last year, but today is 24 and it's just nice, not too hot. <laughs> Them stones. Back in the Titanic now, let's have a little look at the patisserie and then we'll take you across to the other side of where the shops are and there's the Irish bar as well which again we haven't been in yet. Yeah so if you can remember from earlier it was empty but now it's full of different cakes and they are so nice. You have a lot of cheese. I do like the cheesecake. Another bar here. This is where we get our cappuccinos from. Chocolate yeah, and obviously you can get coffee and all your drinks. And the seating area there. Really nice setting. It's lovely. I think this is tonight where we are. 
Yes. Yeah, night snacks, 11 to 2. Then down this way. There's more shops. Clothing. Shop door is so funny. Yeah, you don't really see many people in them. This is the other side of the nightclub. And here is the Irish bar. Loads of TVs. Obviously all the sport is on there. And again, all of your drinks at the bar. We've not even had a drink at the We haven't sat in it yet, no. I like but yeah. in the outside bar. Noble Irish pub. There you go. Yeah, it's like a little chill out area. These stairs take you back up to the lobby and then through here more shops, like souvenirs. And then you have the ball in, the arcade. It's like um, an 80s cinema as well, isn't it? Yeah, sure it's closed. Cool. We'll have a little look though. Hairdresser as well. Yeah. Um, there you go, there's all the game area. Have a little look in there. Sport world. There is the kids club at the back. And you do have a doctor as well. So in here is all of the different arcade games. We think they're included. I don't to be honest, we don't know if they are included or not. Three large pool tables and air hockey there. At the back there is the bowling alley which is currently closed. There you go, I will ask how much this is. So I've just spoken to the guys and yeah we've had confirmation that all of the games including the bowling are free. The bowling is down at the minute though because there's a problem with the computer system. Yeah all of this is free. Let's see how Stacey's doing on the basketball. Oh nearly. Enjoying it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good that it's included. Right, I think we've shown you pretty much the entire resort. Uh, we will pick this up when we go to the seafood and all the cart tonight. So we'll see you there and show you what food we're having there. Here we are then for the evening a la carte at the seafood. It's popular, isn't it? Yeah. As mentioned, 25 euros per person, and it's a three course meal, so I'll show you the menu and we'll get a drink. We're having wine or something. Um, you might have a glass of rosé. Yeah. yeah. That's the only wine I like. <laughs> so we've been brought out all of these little bits to try. Nice salad. I don't really know what. Oh, this is. I think it's cucumber. That's some sort of like yogurt yogurt-y. Sauce. Does look nice. We've That's gone for rosé wine. Let's have a look at the menu. Soup and salad and then you've got your appetizers. Octopus and grilled squid. We've got the grilled salmon, that sounds nice. Yeah, let's uh, show you some food when it comes out. First up then we have a seafood soup. 
looking forward to trying that. And I believe all three appetizers come out. We only actually asked for the octopus and the shrimp, but they've brought out the squid as well. It all looks lovely. Uh, interested to try the octopus. We've never had it. That's the thing when you go to say a seafood restaurant, if you've never tried it before, you don't want to spend a lot of money, do you? No. Um, but well, I might as well here. Yeah, we'll, try them all. we'll try it. So, yes, we'll let you know what it tastes like and then we'll get our mains coming out. I've ordered the salmon and Stacey's gone for the sea bass. Yeah. Enjoy the appetizers. I really, really enjoyed the octopus and also the squid was nice. Yeah. I've never had them too before. Shrimp was beautiful. I um, highly recommend coming to the seafood a la carte. Yeah, I mean, I've got to be honest, I am not the biggest no, fish you're person, not. so you I didn't. Try. I don't. Try. Yeah, I didn't. Really, I love the soup, the uh, the <laughs> seafood soup. I had I had your bowl as yeah. well. But yeah, we've got our mains out now. Obviously, being an a la carte, they are smaller portions. So you've got the sea bass, and here is the salmon, which looks lovely. We're going to have this now. And don't forget, we've always got the option of a late night burger. <laughs> this is, does transform into I the I need any more time. evening snack. Well, it's open until two, so I'll see how we go. Here, what I'll do now then is insert some clips from earlier in the week where we had a bit too much to drink at the nightclub and the evening entertainment, which has been great all week. when it comes shooting out. Woohoo! Me next. <laughs> oh. God, you get soaked there. Yeah, this slide is really fun. The water is cold though. How is that? <laughs> Funny. 
<laughs> I'm not going on that. No way. <laughs> Water slides earlier. Yeah, it's time to show you the evening buffet then. Half six till quarter past nine, Mrs. Antel. We, we were lucky last yesterday, we just made it, didn't we? That yeah. For oh god, yeah, we, we got here about quarter to past nine, something like that. Yeah. But they still had people coming up for food. So again, the kids' corner. Fries. Ah, oh, potato corn, yes, yeah. Yes. There seems to be something different here every day of the week. Mexican. Oh, Mexican, no, missing it. I look lovely. Yeah. Yeah, we had um, baked potato. I didn't have one. I did. And they've had Donna me on one night. Yeah, always something different there. They had a beef brisket burger as well. And then you've got all of your veg and your fish, fried mackerel. Yeah, there's cakes here, but I mean these are out at the patisserie all day long, anyways. But yeah, if you want a dessert, oh really? Yeah. Lovely, nice steak. The old T-bone steak, that's lovely. Turkey, vegetables. Yeah, the mash is nice. Turtle, rice, eggplant. Meat, flatbread, yeah. Over here, we never have bread. No, we've never it, had it. Don't want to fill up on that. And all of the salad the in the salad middle. Yeah, yeah loads of different spinach, How sweet many corn. Have we tried yeah. been here? So many different cheese. Chili con carne. We haven't filmed a, a lunch buffet, but it's similar to this. We've only actually been to it once. We had pasta. Yeah. More salad there. Yeah. A Turkish dessert. Hello. Loads of different meats and cheeses. Again, you can go for fruit here. Yeah. There's too much choice. Yeah. And what I like is there's something for everyone. If you want something healthy, you can. Yeah. If you want chips like this, like steak. At the back they tend to have the, the fries and yeah, um, they usually have like noodles, so it's a beef noodles. Not there tonight, they usually have spring rolls, but they have something similar. And is this the sushi again? Yeah. It's quite busy tonight. Yeah, loads of sushi. Getting freshly made there. In the uh, main hall where people can sit. You can also sit down there. We are actually having a, another a la carte. Hello. Yeah, we're, we're going. We're trying the Italian tonight. 
I won't film it, we've already shown the uh, seafood, but can't wait for that. All of this food's making me hungry though. Yeah, we, did, we actually managed, we managed to get the night time buffet to tomorrow night before we get our flight home. Yeah, we've got a late flight. Hello. Hi. We have a late flight back, getting picked up about seven, so we can make Just this managed. evening buffet. Stuff our faces. Yeah. Because plain food isn't very nice. Yeah, so I'll take you back to the kids' corner and you just exit there. Right, so this brings us to the end of the vlog then. Yeah, it's our last night. Aww. I'm happy to go home, but yeah. I'm also sad because we've had such an amazing week. It's been brilliant, yeah. We're going to go out for drinks tonight, back to the nightclub. Don't you look pretty? <laughs> yeah, so I hope you've enjoyed watching and Hope we've gave you a good comprehensive view of what this hotel has to offer. It's so good, like we will definitely yeah. return. 100% and we were saying today once it's fully renovated, all of the water parks yeah. done in the shore area, it'll be even better. Definitely. We've loved all of the food. We, I don't even think, have we mentioned the drinks? The cocktails are so nice. We love What's pina colada, yeah, the, um, um, moonstar martini. Yeah, oh, that's that's lovely. To, they're all nice, tequila. The so green nice. shots we've, are nice as well. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, we've, we've just had so much nice food. Uh, nothing wrong with it. The service has been brilliant. Yeah. We've loved every second of it, so Aww. highly recommend it. So yeah, that brings us to the end of the video then. If you enjoyed it, please leave a huge like and a comment. And uh, if, yeah, if you want to see the uh, rest of our journey out here in Turkey, we're still going to do the Land of Legends yeah. theme park and yeah, water park. Yeah. And also Akka Park in Antalya. All of them vlogs are still to come on the channel, yeah. so stay tuned. But thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video. Bye.